Problem 28 to go. We're doing great. Find the circumference of circle A with diameter 17 inches. Give your answer in terms of pi. <gasps> a problem after my own heart. Okay, we have a circle. It has a diameter of 17 inches. That's supposed to be inches. Okay, I know that the formula for circumference is equal to pi times the diameter, which means the answer is 17 pi. Find the area of a regular decagon. Decagon, how many sides does the decagon have? Decade, 10 years. Decagon, 10 sides. A side length of 18 meters and an apothem of 27.7 meters. So if we have 10 sides, and each side length is 18 meters, then my perimeter is equal to 180 meters. The formula for area of a regular polygon is 1 half times the apothem times the perimeter, I'm given the apothem of 27.7 meters, one half, times 27.7, times 180. I've got a calculator and I am not afraid to use it. So what am I going to do here? I am going to say 180 multiply times 27.7 divided by 2 and that gives me 2,493.0 if they want rounding, point zero meters squared. Here we have a plan for a pond and I need to draw a composite figure to estimate its area. The scale is one square, side length is one yard. How on earth am I going to draw this puppy? Let me think. You know what I think I'm going to do? I think I am going to make this a triangle and I'm going to make this a rectangle and I am going to say that this is more or less This is pretty crude, but I'm going to call that too. It's not exactly right, but that's what I'm going to call it. And I'm going to say this is one, one, two, three, four, five and a half. The square root, let's see. And this line is going to be 
That's one, one, two, three, four, five and a half. Five point five squared. Five point five squared is thirty point twenty five plus one squared thirty one point twenty five. Take the square root of that. The square root of 31.25 is about 5.6. So I'm going to say this line here is 5.6. The area of the triangle is 1 half times 2 times 5.6. Half of 2 is 1, so I'm going to call the area of the triangle about 5.6 square yards. I'm going to pretend that this is a parallelogram of height 3 and base 5.6. Five point six times three. I'm going to call the area of my big part here sixteen point eight yards square. I'm going to add to that the area of my triangle. And the area of my pond, and why would you marry a, why would you measure an area of a pond in square yards anyway? I cannot imagine. Um, 22.4 square yards. If I want it closer, I'm going to have to call a surveying company and pay some actual money. Good. We're almost done.